good? Good morning, everyone. If you wouldn't mind taking your seats. Ready. Here we go. I'm Jill Schlesinger, the Executive Vice President of Strategic Point Investment Advisors in Providence and host of the Making Money Show. I always like to give my show a little plug, 920 WHJJ. I will be the moderator of the Governor's Economic Forum today. First, let me thank you all for coming in today. Rainy day, traffic on 95. We appreciate it. It's a very important event. And thanks, too, to the Governor's entire staff who have worked tirelessly to pull this off in a very short period of time. I want to start the morning off with two quotes. Set the tone. You meet your destiny on the road you take to avoid it. Psychiatrist Carl Jung was talking about the human psyche, but the application to our current financial crisis is particularly apt. How each individual, business, organization, and municipality faces the current economic challenges can define future success. Today is not a day to avoid the hard truths. Today is a day to confront our situation with candor and create solutions that will help us achieve our goals. Today we will meet our collective destiny not by avoiding what we fear, but by facing it and producing actionable agenda items for the state to pursue. The next quote is from W. Edwards Deming. Now, I didn't know a lot about this guy. Some of you may know more about him. He was a statistician who is known as the father of Japanese post-war industrial revival. He noted, it is not necessary to change. Survival is not mandatory. <laughs> here is a man who understood that if nothing changes, nothing changes. We are here today because Governor Kacheri recognizes that the state and the nation as a whole are what we in the investment business call at an inflection point. That is, an event that changes the way we think and act. Those who are creative will not only survive but thrive when the eventual recovery takes place. Our job today is to come together, stop talking about the past, and proactively meet the economic and fiscal challenges facing Rhode Island. With that said, I would like to introduce your host of the Economic Forum, Governor Donald L. Kacheri.